Hello, here's another update with the Raspberry Pi and the iMac G3. I have actually figured out how to send the initialization code to the iPad board from the Raspberry Pi so you can do it without an Arduino if you just want to hook up a Raspberry Pi. Uh, the only downside is is that you don't see the boot sequence and, and, when, and then when it turns on the iPad board it's already in the desktop or you know wherever it is that your default login is. <clears throat> But it works, and then if you reboot, you know, after it's been initialized, then you see the, the boot up sequence. So I'm going to show you guys here. Um, I've already turned on the CRT, but the board is not initialized. The Raspberry Pi is going to do that. And so I'm just going to plug it in. And you can see that the Pi is on, but there is nothing on the screen. And so give it about 30 seconds or so. Okay, I just heard it come on and there it is. And, you know, this is very preliminary, but what I have is a Python script. This one I called it init ibad.py. <coughs> Okay, I guess I accidentally just ran it. But uh, basically, you know, I just copy pasted from the Arduino code and then I just made these two functions to make it easy. It was pretty easy to port over, it wasn't that bad. So now I'm going to show you if I reboot, you can see the whole process. Now it has been initialized. There you have it. So if you only have a Raspberry Pi, you can do it without an Arduino. And if you don't want to have an Arduino, you can do it just with a Raspberry Pi.